Final text editor for Android Tamox. So the first thing you have to ensure is to install is to make sure Tamox is installed on the device. So I have mine installed here already, but just in case you don't have yours, go to the Play Store, then you look for the app Tamox. Then this first one over here, I have mine installed already, so just install it, but I'll just open mine from here. You can see my Tamox um, interface is open. The first thing I want to check now is to see if Nano is installed, so which Nano, W-H-I-C-H, -H, Nano. You can see it is giving me the path where Nano is installed. This shows that Nano is available on my uh, Linux and on my Tamox, but if it is not available on yours, you can do PKG install nano you can also pass the y flag okay so if you run this command it will install nano for you then after running this command to confirm that nano is installed you can run nano then you say version you can see my nano is up to date version 8.4 so i can just uh, move on now we go ahead to basic nano usage okay i'll show you how to create a file how to um, edit existing files how to save it and all that so i'll create a new folder mkdir i'll call it notes okay just for this tutorial cd notes okay so in notes ls at the moment i don't have any um any text files here i don't have any files at all in this particular directory and i want to create a new file two options i have the first one is to type nano directly then it will give me this interface where I can type anything I want to type. So you don't have to be switching between command modes and insert modes and all that. Just type. Okay. So I have this um, content that I've added to this particular file. You will see um, at the top of the screen, you can see GNU Nano 8.4. Then in the middle, you are seeing new buffer. This particular content that we typed, it is saved, but not on this particular um on the particular directory where we are, where the notes directory that we created. So for me to be able to save this file now, if you look at the base of the screen just above the escape uh, button, you will see caret G, caret X, um, caret O, caret F and all that. So just note each of these um, commands over here. Then for me to be able to save this particular file, I can just do the caret, it stands for control. Okay, so I just press control, then O. You can see it is asking me where to, where to, where to file. So I'll just type in the name of the file. I can say file.txt. Okay, then enter. And you can see it is no longer new buffer. It is now file.txt. So I can just exit the text editor now. How can I do that? Just control X and I'm out. Okay, if I run ls once more, you can see file.txt. Use cat to confirm the contents of file.txt 